new store just opened this past weekend in Kennewick that benefits Seattle Children's Hospital. You may have heard about it just a few minutes ago. That's right. It's a store that allows you to give back to a worthy cause. Our Barry Roy joins us at the Seattle's Children's Boutique with more on how you can give back. Good morning, Barry. Good morning, guys. Yes, it's a fantastic store, fantastic uh, vision and mission. Let's talk about that with Joanne Hoff right now. Joanne, let's talk about the Seattle Children's Bargain Boutique. What is this type of store? Good morning. Um, this Bargain Boutique is a store of um, quality merchandise. We have uh, corporate donations as well as caliber private donations from uh, local people. And uh, we sell the products here in the store and every penny goes for the Children's Hospital and Compensated Care program. And let's talk about the uncompensated care and why that is so important because we talked about this a couple of days ago you and I it's super important isn't it? Yes well th that's why we're here the uncompensated program ensures that every child regardless of their family's ability to pay will receive quality state-of-the-art care where whatever their situation they'll be treated at Children's Hospital with the utmost respect and care. And let's tell I me, mean, out here there's 2,500 plus kids that were treated at uh, Seattle Children's uh, last year in 2015. And let's talk about uh, the kids here. And, and it's so important around the world in our neck of the woods. Let's talk about the kids around here, how important, because it's really important to you. you. This is something that you dealt with. Oh yes, the children here, they think, oh dear, I've got to go clear to Seattle to, to get treatment, but that's okay. You go over there and you get the quality treatment that you need. For us, there was no other place to go. Uh, we, we went to Children's and they saved our son's life. So um, it's, it's huge in, in the community's eyes in having a place to go and be safe and take their children. All right, so we're going to have more with Joanne here in just a little bit. We'll send it back to you guys in studio. We'll talk about donations, all that in the next half an hour. We'll send it back to you guys in, in studio. Great cause, for sure. Absolutely. So we'll check in with them in a bit. Yes, we will. You can give back. Good morning, Barry. Uh, good morning, Jaden. Yes, there are various ways that you can give back, of course, to children. Come in, make a purchase, 100% of those proceeds going to Seattle Children's uh, Hospital. And I'm with Joanne Hoff again this morning. But there's other ways that people can help and donations. You are always taking donations. Talk to us about how people can come down and donate to this cause. We have a donation center that's open from 10 till 4 every day, including Saturday. We're closed on Sundays. Bring anything that you're willing to part with. Uh, we take clothes, housewares, furniture, artwork, books, tapes, and it, just anything. And we then we go through it and process it in our processing room. And then, of course, everything goes towards uh, to Seattle Children's Hospital. Talk to us about how that all works in your proceeds. All the proceeds from all the things that we process that go out on the floor, every penny then goes back to the Children's Hospital for the Uncompensated Care Program. And if a person is not able to bring their items, say they have a a small dresser or something like that they'd like to give. Uh, they could give us a call and, or come down and shop and then we'll go to their home. We have a van and we can do a pickup service. And let's also, let's look at this here. This is also an application. You guys want volunteers to come down as oh. well and help out as much as possible. The volunteers are the heart of the, of the boutique. Without the volunteers, we couldn't operate. So the volunteers, uh, you can decide when you want to volunteer. Uh, you can pick if you want to work in the morning, work in the afternoon, which days you want to work. If you want to work in the back room, you want to work on the floor, you want to rotate. Usually it's four-hour shift, and we have a fabulous group of people who've already vol started volunteering, but we need more. And of so. course, they are <laughs> always looking for more. And if you want some more information, you can certainly come on down. They're open today, 930 until 5 o'clock. I've also linked their website to ours. Just go to kvutv.com and click on news links for more information. Jason. We'll send it back to you in studio.